All right, hey everyone, welcome back to the Barbell Medicine YouTube channel. I'm Dr. Jordan Feigenbaum. It's another Tuesday, so you know what it is. It's Two Minute Tuesday. This time, with the help of Dr. Baraki, we're going to talk about walking out the squat. Hi, team. Hi, Hi Dad. So the squat walkout seems overall fairly mundane when we talk about squatting in general. However, there are multiple issues that you can run into when walking out the squat incorrectly. Ultimately, we want to make for a very consistent, efficient, and tight setup. So we'll have Dr. Baraki uh, help us out here with, the, with Leah and Tom and Alan show us what not to do and what to do on the squat. So without further ado, let's get to the video. So what we'd like to do is we'd like to make the setup as simple as possible, make it repeatable and very consistent. Basically, every single unrack and walkout from the empty bar up to a 1RM type weight should look the same. So there are a few considerations here. We'd like to take as few steps as possible out of the rack in order to get a safe distance away from the hooks. We'd also like to take as few steps and shuffle around as little as possible to establish our correct toe angle. And finally, how many steps you take out of the rack might depend on how much room you have. So if your rack is particularly deep, you might have more room. If your rack is a little shallow, you might not have as much room. So you have to take that into consideration. Generally, what we like to do is to take either one step with each foot out of the rack, or to do a three-step walkout that Leah will demonstrate for us. Alright, so thanks for tuning in to the Barbell Medicine YouTube channel. Hit like below if you dug the video. Leave us a comment about what you want to see next and make sure to subscribe for all the latest content. Thanks again for watching. Catch you guys next time.